everyone so today i'm going to be showing you all what i carry in my makeup kit uh so i always moisturize at home i don't carry a moisturizer uh outside anywhere in my handbag or my gym kit or whatever so but i always carry a sunscreen lotion and this is zo sunscreen health lotion and uh it's been really good it doesn't have a tint it's also a primer uh so this is sunscreen plus a primer so it's a two in one and uh it helps me carry just one product that just two things and uh i've been using it for a year now and it's really good so i think this is something that you guys should try so sunscreen is something that i carry uh after sunscreen i always apply uh a concealer so this is la pro concealer and uh this is my concealer this is um the shade is called toast and i use this as my concealer and i think everywhere uh let's just say we go out and i finish a day of work and i'm going out for a party or i'm meeting my friends for dinner uh a quick concealer and i think uh some foundation is the best thing to do so this is my concealer uh after that i have a foundation this is from maybelline uh it's a super stay maybelline and uh, i think it's a really good foundation um it's not expensive it's budget friendly and i think every day if you need to apply foundation you have work you're going to meet some friends or you just have let's say finish work and you're going out for dinner or a few drinks or whatever uh i think just a quick to refresh your face uh using expensive products would just not be that budget friendly so this is my budget friendly foundation i use smashbox as well uh smashbox is something i use only if there's a big event or i'm going to meet a director or i'm going to meet someone special or whoever i use smashbox but this is my workwear or let's just say i'm going out in the night just some simple dinner so uh this is the foundation uh it's called It's called Sun Beige and it's in the number 310. It's a really really nice foundation. So to top it all, I use Fit Me loose powder. This is in the shade medium. Uh this is a loose powder and it really feels light on the face. It's not heavy and it's not highly pigmented also. So it doesn't change the color of your foundation. So I really like this. It's a uh, Fit Me. They have they have different shades as well. uh for light for medium skin tone for dark skin tone and i think it's they're doing really well actually uh after this i highlight my face uh i have two highlighters i have one in ny bay uh and the other one is in maybelline uh the colors are almost different so this is something i use for night and this is something i use for day uh so that this doesn't highlight my cheeks a little too much and in the night if i'm using a little bit of glitter eye shadow or whatever i think this looks really nice this is for my work my day makeup i'm just going out with my family i'm i'm here for work uh i use this uh i also use a fit me maybelline matte uh pressed powder this is to set my foundation this is the last step that i use for my foundation and uh this is really good and it's in pure beige and i think it suits my foundation a lot uh so that's the, that's with my uh base uh for contour i use sugar it's a sugar palette contour that i use and just in case in the night i want a deeper contour i use my concealer as my contour it's a wet concealer obviously so i blend it more to give a, a chiseled look This is something I use for day. It's a powder contour and it really looks nice. It's warm and it just creates that shadow that I need. Um I use two blush cheek rose or whatever you want to call it. This is sugar. A uh, really nice baby pink lightish pink. It 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 doesn't show that much as well. Okay? Uh so this is one I use. The other than that to give myself a sun-kissed look, I use this beetroot tint and this is something um which is looks really good for the day it gives you a flushed look 
uh, like you've been sun kissed and um, this is something I use and it smells really really good you can use it as a lip balm you can use it as a, a blush or um, anything you want so this do sometimes I use it on the eye and then I go over it with uh, a powder blush or a powder uh, eyeshadow so this is my face uh, for my eyebrow I use Swiss Beauty uh, this has got a color for the eyebrow and a wax um, this is something that I use on a daily basis because I don't want to work too much on my eyebrow so in case I'm going out let's say for a wedding or something I use pack I use Mac which is all at home uh, this is something I, do, I don't carry so much in my the little kit this is just you know um, to give myself a touch up you know so this is something I use it's got three powders it's got three powders and uh, it's got this is the color I use I, you also use these two as an eyeshadow sometime if I forget to bring my shadow and this is a wax to keep your uh, eyebrow in place I have thick eyebrows so I need the wax um, and I have no intentions of uh, making it thin so I, I need the wax um, for my eye I stick to Nykaa Nude Shade Palette this has got all the shades uh, that works well for for a day makeup the colors are really nice and it's very uh, warm it's brown it's nude there are two pink shades as well and also just in case I am just I've decided to just go out immediately right after work there are shades that have glitter on it pressed powder and they're really really good uh, so I, I keep this handy with me so that just in case let's say I can't carry my big palettes this is something that I take with me all the time this is something I carry everywhere let's say I decided to go out for a party and I need something that's shiny this is what I use this is Fenty and this is an expensive product that I gifted myself um, it's a wet eyeshadow palette uh, a, a box and it's really cool because when you touch it it's wet but when you apply it's powder and it's really dry and I think it's got real it's pigmented so well that you know if it's dark and there's a lot of light you, you know you're shining and it's really nice so this is an amazing product that um, I love also I have a loose glitter powder just in case I need more shine I use a it's from pack so it's got so much shimmer it's powder glitter and it looks really nice uh, I sometimes drop it all over my collarbone the chest area sometimes my arm so I look like I'm shining uh, sometimes when I get crazy I just drop it a little bit of, on my hair not just go all overboard but just a little bit to give that shine uh, I have a liner which is from Nykaa uh, it's a liquid liner and uh, I think I use a liquid liner only because you know the the applicator is really thin and you know I can get maybe a thick liner or wing liner easily uh, I don't use a pen liner because I think it dries out too quick and sometimes I don't have I, uh, the, the cap just gets opened and it's somewhere else in the bag and the, the liner the pencil could dry out so I don't like to use a pencil I don't apply kajal that much uh, so I don't carry a kajal I always carry a lash glue because I'm always wearing lashes and I don't know when let's say I'm going for a movie and I cried or someone made me cry or I got emotional and the lash comes off I have a glue handy all the time and I have two mascaras one is Manish Malhotra and the other one is Smashbox uh, they're really good sometimes I don't like to use my lash let's say when I'm just sometimes coming for work or it's just a half an hour meeting or something like that I like to use just mascara and no lashes so these are the two mascaras that I always carry now with lipstick I have a lot of shades so I'm going to show you guys one by one this is Bellora Paris it's got a little it's a tangerine color like a, a tomato a tomato color it's like reddish with pink uh, the color I'm using right now I'm wearing right now is Bellora Paris I also have a brown Maybelline uh, Super Stay 
and this is something that i use only if i need let's say i'm doing a brown a blue color eye makeup or a green green color or lavender and i can't keep i can't do pink lips i stick to brown um this is a uh, lakme and they're really cute they're just like 150 or 200 rupees each and it's really cute it's mini matte melt and this is a uh, this is light brown and this is pink Sometimes I like to keep variety because sometimes I mix two shades, and uh, it just gives a nice look. The other one is Nykaa as well. This is a uh, pink. It's got a little nude tint to it, but it's pink as well, and it's really nice. And I love Nykaa products because uh, I think the uh, the uh, the uh, when I say makeup, it's not just the product; it's also the the brand itself is really good. They test their products; it's verified. and the delivery is so good it just comes in like a day so i i love nykaa i keep two beauty blenders one is for my concealer and one is for my foundation uh, i mix them i also have a a brush kit that i use this was gifted by my sister uh, the the box itself not the brushes and i have variety of brushes uh let's say this is for powder it's a fluffy brush um and it covers the whole of your face so i like to use this uh this is my foundation brush i mix this with my beauty blender sometimes if i see there's a lot of lines on my face after applying uh, the foundation using a brush uh i try to correct it with a beauty blender uh this is my contour brush and it's angled so you can angle it well and shape your face well and the rest of my brushes are all eye brushes i don't have a lip brush because i use just matte finish liquid lipstick so the applicator itself is like a a lip liner so that is my makeup brush and my makeup kit uh it's very simple and uh, nothing here is expensive other than fenty uh leaving that aside everything is budget friendly and i've gotten all of this in 3000 4000 and this comes for at least 2 3 months and then you restock it again so i think uh with work and your schedule and then you don't you can't go back home and you can't come back and get ready i just prefer carrying this everywhere it's small it's handy and it fits my handbag well as well so uh this is my makeup kit <laughs> I think you need to first have a a concealer. A concealer is very important because let's say suddenly you have marks, you have scars and you finished your day and now you've decided to do something else. Uh I think concealer corrects half your face with where you have a uh, pigmentation or any kind of mark. And once that gets covered, I think you have a little more confidence in yourself. that okay my problematic areas are covered now what what else second is i think you should i always carry a dry foundation it comes in a palette like a compact so that covers your uh, concealer so that is something that i i think you need to have a compact that works both as a foundation and a powder uh and the sec the last thing is i think a lipstick which is uh, a pink color so you can use the same tint for your cheeks a little bit on the eye and just blend it out so your lipstick can work as your eye shadow and your blush so i think these are the three things that are important let's just make this question five five things would i carry two other things that i would carry is a mascara which is very important your eyes look really nice and open when you uh, are using a good mascara and i think the fifth one is a sunscreen you guys need to carry your sunscreen wherever you go because your skin is so important and all of this will not work if you don't have this you need a sunscreen so that's something that i suggest everyone can so half of you might be wondering how do i know what is my concealer what is my foundation what suits me well uh why should i use a particular product and why it may not work on somebody else and why it would work on you uh if you want to know more and you want to know what is the technique and uh, where to buy my products and what kind of looks i can achieve uh 29th of march we are going to start our ba first batch in english 
and it's a 24 day course and we have successfully completed three batches in another language in Kannada and now we get a, we're getting a lot of requests so that you, we wanted to start in English for you guys as well so register and uh, whoever's registered I will see you in class